Yo, what is up guys, Tech Tonic here, and today I'm bringing you some more Euro Truck Simulator 2, and we are right where we left off in the last video, which is, of course, Southampton, and we're already going to be heading off again. Um, like I said, I was going to follow up the last video with another one, uh, and we're going to be going, oh, missed it, there we go, we're going to be going to Calais, which is over here. Uh, so we're in Southampton. I th where did we start off last episode? Manchester, Birmingham, or something? Uh, or was it Cardiff? No, I think it was Cardiff. Yeah, then we came to Southampton. Now we're going to Calais, and our, basically our mission is to get as far north as possible, which is probably that place right there. Uppsala. <laughs> Apologies if you're from there. Um, so I've pronounced that wrong. So yeah, that's where that's our aim. So we're basically just going to do that. Don't worry, I'm not going to be doing it video after video after video. Um, because I like to mix it up, but I did say that I would do a uh, another one on this channel straight after the last one. So, uh, that's what we're doing, basically. Let's just... Whoa! That, whoa! Oh, that was a lot closer than I thought. Ignore that. We haven't started yet. We haven't started yet, guys. Right. Let's just back ourselves in here. Boom. Okay, now we've started. Anything that goes wrong here is fair enough. Transing it. Oh, shoot, we're tired. Shoot. Oh, God, guys. I didn't plan this well, did I? I oh, that's quite a trek, isn't it? And it's the train. It's, it's the train. We're not going from Dover. You don't get a rest on the train. We're going to have to get a rest stop right now. Jeez, this does not go well, does it, for us? All right, we're going to turn left here. And uh, we're going to get this that rest stop just over there, that hotel there. Um, that's going to be the plan then, I guess. Because uh, I do apologise. I have not planned well for that. I should have got a rest before I uh, started. I remember now, actually. I remember saying that we need to go rest the next time we start a video. <laughs> um, so, yeah. I'm glad I remembered that. Is that a Corsa? That's my car. Right. Let's just... Trailers aren't really meant to be in here, so let's just come up on here for a second because we all, We've all been there. We've tried to maneuver a trailer inside this place. So look at that beautiful parking spot Thought I was gonna tip there um, But yeah, that's okay. We'll just leave that there for a sec. It's over the white line So, you know, it's not gonna harm anyone Except another trailer that comes by. So let's just whack ourselves in here. Hello, Scania. Yeah, I'm right here. Don't need to keep telling me that I'm tired. Oh, I've got to stop the engine. There we go. Right, let's just get some rest real quick. Hopefully, we've still got plenty of time. I really don't know. God, I really don't know. I can't press F7 as well. I forgot that I did that last time and it stopped the recording. I forgot to change the hotkey on that. I'll do that at some point. I've got to remember to do that. Because... I can't do it today because, well, I mean, I can't do it now because we're filming. Right, or oh, recording, I should say. Oh, it's there. Right, I was thinking, where's it gone? Okay, a trailer's just, we're just cutting into it there, but that's okay. We just need to, there we go, boom, we're attached. That's coming up. Good, right, let's go. Now we're on track. We're just going to do a quick swing in the road here. Beautiful. And now we're going. Hopefully we'll get through these lights because I don't really want to stop. There's a police car. Right, so we're off now. Four hours and four minutes to go. And I can't actually see how long we've got left because I can't press F7. It's not going well so far, is it? Last, the last one went pretty well, didn't it? I don't think anything bad happened. I don't think it did, did it? Unless someone can remember something that I can't. Speaking fence, great. Oh, there's another speed camera. Oh, was the last one a police car? Yeah, so... I did, I think last time it went all well, didn't it? You know, usually something goes wrong in these Euro Truck videos. We all know that on this channel. Um, but I think last time it went okay. I don't think there were any problems at all. Everything went quite smoothly, so... Uh, so far, not so much on this one. We definitely can't count that 1% damage we got at the beginning. Because uh, that, that definitely didn't count. I can't even attach my trailer yet. Although, 
I did accept the job, so maybe we should count it. Anyway, right, so we're going to basically be driving along here to Southampton. Then, oh, we've got to be in the other lane. Always forget that. Uh, driving along uh, from Southampton down towards Dover, and then we're going to get the train, which is just outside of Dover, um, and go across. And if you are new to Eurotruck, um, that is quite an important fact to remember that you don't get rest on the train. I learned that a long time ago. Uh, by mistake, uh, you don't get rest on the train like you do on uh, on the ferry. I mean, at least that's what it was like then. I mean, I haven't played this game in so long until I started playing it again on this channel like a year ago. And in this whole year that I've been playing ETS 2 on this channel, I don't think we've crossed on a train yet. So I haven't really found out if they've updated it or anything. Which they might have done by now. Who knows? Who knows? Because I don't see why you wouldn't be able to risk on a train. I don't see why not. But, um, yeah, that's basically that's the gist of the story there. So, 3 hours 40 minutes. Does, so does that include the ferry ride, that 3 hours 40 minutes? I assume it does. It's not a very long ferry, is it? I mean, it's only like an hour and a half in real life, I think. I think. Last time I went across the ferry from Calais, uh, sorry, from Dover to Calais, it was 2014, I believe. So I was 14, almost 15, I got, because I went in the summer and my birthday is in September. So I go turn 15 like one or two months later, depending on when I went. I can't remember if it was July or August. But yeah, I went on like a, uh, like a European holiday sort of thing, like. Um, like driving around Europe, which was quite different to what we usually do. Usually we like go to, um, like, I mean, for the summer holiday sort of thing, we go to one country and then we'll still like travel around that country. But this one, this holiday was obviously traveling a lo around loads of different countries. I think we went to 13 in total, literally just driving around Europe for uh, two weeks, I think it was. Uh, just over two weeks. So 13 countries in just over two weeks. Including the UK, of course. <laughs> uh, yes, yeah, so I think it was uh, UK. Let me let me see if I can try and name them. Uh, UK, France, obviously, uh, and then I think I'm trying to do them in order. That's why I'm tr thinking so hard. Um, then I think it was we went through Belgium. I think first, or did we go straight into Luxembourg? No, we went straight into Luxembourg. But we went Belgium on the way back. I'll just I'll, I'll just do them as, as I can remember. So, right, so uh, UK, France, Belgium, Luxembourg, uh, Netherlands, uh, Germany, Slovakia, Slovenia, Hungary, Croatia. How many is that? Ten, I think. Liechtenstein, eleven. Austria, twelve. What's the other one? Oh, that's gonna bug me now, isn't it? Oh, what's the other one? I really can't remember. Wait, hold on, I've got my phone here. Do not do what I'm doing, guys. Do not drive and go on your phone. Because you'll probably crash. Do not follow this example, right? Where's my list of countries? Uh, there it is. Uh, France, Germany. Yes, 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 of course. Um, France, Germany, Spain. I can go Spain on that trip. Oh, Italy. Yeah, I went to Italy. That was it as well. Uh, dipped into Italy, the north of Italy, which uh, uh, so I went to Venice and um, Lake Gaza, I think it's called Gaza or Gaga, I can't remember. Uh, yeah, so there you go, 13 countries. Right, oh, police car, right, uh, what was I going to say, 2 hours 57 minutes to go. It's not actually gone that fast, has it? I thought it would have been quicker. Oh, it's F6 to get all that information out. I was going to say, I swear we've got that information up loads and it's never stopped recording. Uh, what does F7 do then? Oh, F7 is to call a um, call for assistance, so we don't, definitely don't need that. Ah, okay, so we've got plenty of time. Look, remains 8 hours 12 minutes, and uh, we've got 2 hours 51 minutes to go, so we've got plenty of time. We're getting about 6,200, or 6,300 is closer to for this job, and we're carrying roof tiles. Interesting. <laughs> oh, we've got a tunnel here. You, you wouldn't expect roof tiles to be in here. Uh, oh, let's go back to here. 
speed camera there. We're okay though, 53. It's not bad, is it? Oh god, I keep going all over the place. Uh, are we going to overtake this guy? I hope we don't have to because that's going to be embarrassing when it turns to 60 for them again. Oh, we're catching up. We're going to have to. I'm definitely not turning off my cruise control. Just for that little bit, little amount of time. Here we go. Here's the, here's the speed change. He's probably going to go and undertake me again. Unless we uh, try to squeeze ourselves in here. There you go. That's it. Drop back, mate. Drop yourself back. Boom. And now he's going to go and overtake me. <laughs> All right. Oh. I just suddenly thought something. I, <laughs> I don't know why I said that out loud. I suddenly thought something that i got to do. I won't tell you that, though. I'm glad. See, see. Uh, actually, what I was going to tell you was that, um, like, my schedule for this channel is Tuesdays and Fridays, and I was just going to explain that if I ever miss one, it's just because I've had something else that I've got to do that day. That's like simply it. Because, like, I've got so much going on in my life right now that I set my my recording days for both channels. So, like. For this channel, I record my Tectonic video on a Monday, release it on a Tuesday, and then I record the other Tectonic video on a Wednesday and release it on a Friday. So, that's, and the reason I do that is because they're the only two days in the week that I'm not working in the evenings, because during the day, I'm at school, Monday to Friday, Sunday, I'm at my, one of my jobs during the day, and then four evenings a week I'm at my second job you know in the evenings from like 5 p.m. onwards so basically the only free time I have is on a Sunday evening on a Monday evening a Wednesday evening and Saturday during the day they're the only sort of four slots of time free time that I have so I use Saturday during the day for my Jack's Upsets videos video I use uh, obviously today, Monday for Tuesday's video, and then Wednesday for Friday's video. Sorry if that's confusing. Uh, which then just leaves Sunday evening, which is what I usually just, I, I guess, just call it a miscellaneous day. I just do anything that I've got to catch up on. Like if I do miss a tectonic video, or uh, I think I've got some schoolwork to do, or revise for exams, or whatever. That's when, uh, that's like, I don't know. That's the mix and match day, I guess you can call it. Um, so yeah, I just wanted to let you know if, if I ever do miss a video, that's why, because if I have to suddenly do something on the Monday or whatever, or I even simply forget, I have forgot sometimes, then it's basically then because I've got literally no other spare time to get it done. So that's the situation there, basically. I hate these roads. I like it on the motorway. Because these roads, one, can be slower. Right now it's okay though. And two, you sometimes do have to start. I thought I was about to get a speaking phone there. I suddenly took my finger off the button. Look, like, right now, why is it going so slow? Sorry, guys, I've got to overtake because cause you know what's up. Oh, shoot. Shoot. This is the channel tunnel. We have to go back in. Oh, shoot. Definitely not illegal what I just did there. Seriously, guys, if you're, it's the first time you're playing this game, do not copy me. I'm a horrible, horrible example. Right, there we go, channel tunnel, here we go. Turn left, this guy knows where he's going. He's going channel tunnel as well, except he definitely won't, because no one else turns in here except me. Right, <clears throat> where are we going? I remember the first time I came down here, it was like absolutely chucking it down with rain. It was absolutely pissing it down. I have no idea where I'm going. I still don't. Oh, shoot. It says lorries down there. That's closed. Okay. Right. Cars down there. And nothing down there. My phone's going off. What? Cars down there. What? Oh, shoot. Almost hit a police car. What the hell is going on? Where do I go? I still don't know where I'm going on this game. Can we turn in here? Sort of. Yeah, that's it. 
Let's just turn ourselves around. Is there another entrance that we can just slip out of? No, there's not. We're going to have to swing it all the way around. There we go. Right, what is going on? Why can't I go down the the ramp? There we go, just slide ourselves out there. Right, look, first lane, neither. Second lane, cars only. Third lane, ah, now it says bus, uh, sorry, now it says lorries only, HGVs. But there it says you can't. Oh, this is, oh god, this is confusing. Let's just go in here. That is well confusing. Oh, okay, there we go. I should have just looked for the freaking green, big green floating truck. <laughs> that would have probably told me. Right, let's get ourselves on. Come on, there we go. Destination. I'm going to probably pick Calais here, I'm not going to lie. 300 euros, though. That's already knocked our uh, sum down to about 6k, then. Plus that damage we sustained at the beginning. Right, are we going left or right here? Don't tell you much, does it? Let's try left. I like how it looks exactly the same as it does in the UK. Like, they've just copied and pasted the entire model. Alright. Let's exit out of here. Because I'm done. And look at that. Only an hour to go. Okay, so I don't think that did include the ferry ride. Uh, sorry, the train ride, did it? Like, I'm pretty sure it was like an hour and two minutes when we got on the train. Interesting. I'm sure there's nothing going to be coming, considering it's a gag end that way. Oh. Okay. Road closed. Okay. I definitely can't remember this. Is this all one way, I'm guessing? Either way. I don't care, because there's nothing here. I think this is all one way, so I think I can be in the left lane here. Right, and then, okay. I think we should have gone the other way out, because look at that red mark on the map, look the GPS. It's like it's acting like we should have came out the other way, but why would we be facing that way? Anyway, who cares, that's boring. Stop, it says. 19 mile per hour road. It's taking the piss. Right. Let's go. I'm so tired right now, by the way. Sorry if I'm not as energetic as I usually am. Not that I am very much in these videos. I am in my other videos, like, I don't know, GTA and Rocket League. But these ones, I don't tend to be anyway, because it's quite a relaxing game. You know, that's how it's meant to be. It's not meant to be, like, anything crazy happening. It's meant to be just, you know, you're going around, along on a little ride, you know? A chilled, relaxed little drive. That's all it is. But, yeah, just sorry if I'm even less enthusiastic than I would normally be. It's just that I'm tired right now. I am, I am, I am. I got, at least I got to work tonight, but I got work tomorrow. Tomorrow evening. I don't know what it is, though. It, it seems to be that whenever I don't have work, I feel really tired in the evenings. And then when I do have work, I never feel tired at all. You know, like, it's not even just like when I'm there. You know, it's not, it's not like on a, say, like, I always work Tuesday evenings. And then, you know, I get in from school and I've got an hour until I've got to go to work. It's not like, oh, I'm really tired, I don't feel like going. And then when I do get there, I'm okay. It's just that, you know, the whole evening, before I go and after, I'm, after I've come back, I'm never tired. I don't know what it is. I suppose that works out quite well, doesn't it? That I'm only tired uh, on days that I don't actually have to work. Is this bus actually going for the overtake? Is he actually going for the overtake? This guy's insane. I'm going at 56 miles an hour. Look at him. Jesus Christ. Look at this guy. Oh, I'm turning off now, mate. So see ya. God, he's dodgy, isn't he? Is that bus full of school kids? Could kill them. Jeez. That actually reminds me of when I was on a driving lesson once. There was this, literally this bus that was going at like 90 miles an hour. It just flew right past us. I was like, okay, right. And then it slowed down to 70, which is the speed I was going at, because it was a dual carriageway. So, you know, I wasn't doing anything illegal, guys. Don't worry. Um, I don't know why I kept looking right. <laughs> uh, yeah, so, like, this bus, it then slowed down to 70, and we caught up with it and overtook it. And then it overtook us again. It, it, it exchanged a couple more times, and then literally my instructor was like, right, this guy's dangerous. 
put your foot down and get past him. I don't care if you break the speed limit. So I was just like, okay, fine. And I literally just whacked at my foot down and sped past him until he was out of sight. So there you go. Stay away from dangerous bus drivers, guys. Because clearly they're that dangerous you can break the speed limit. <laughs> I'm joking, I'm joking, guys. Don't worry, I'm joking. You know. Don't ever break the speed limit on the road. Health and safety, you know. Not really health and safety because it's like nothing to do with health, it's just safety. <laughs> it's not a business, you know. Right, 19 minutes. And we're there. Alright, so then that concludes part two of our trip to Scandinavia. Not that like, I'm calling this part two or anything, I'm just saying. Uh, and then hopefully we'll go next video, whenever that comes out, from Calais to... I don't know, I'm not sure. Calais to somewhere, basically, guys. Calais to somewhere. Somewhere east. Because that's the general direction we need to go at to get to Scandinavia. Holy shoot. Good job going behind us. If these guys would indicate, that would be absolutely wonderful. Right. That guy, indicate, mate. Actually indicate. What are you doing? If you're turning right, indicate right. All of you. Because there's no straight over. Says the one not indicating. <laughs> okay, nice. Freaking dickhead. Oh, God. Cool, blimey. Drivers on this game get on your nerves, don't they? I'm glad we're here, though. Six minutes. Now right, we've got to turn right up here. Come on, guys. Move. Move. I'm not waiting. There we go. Through. Sharp turn. Oh, that was a quick one. Then a left up here. I like how almost every building on this game is just like some sort of industrial building or a warehouse or something. Like, you don't really get many houses, do you? I think you do on the new uh, Italia pack. And I actually think you do uh, see quite a few on the um, Scandinavia pack. Because, like I said... Oh, jeez. Yeah, we've got a red signal fence. <laughs> I was trying to press the right indicator and I forgot to break. Um, yeah, like when, I, like I said, I, had, I did have a look at the Scandinavia pack on my personal uh, account on Eurotruck. Like I've got two accounts. Um, and actually, uh, I think they were like, it did look a lot more realistic with all the buildings and stuff. Right, let's park ourselves in here. Last time, I think as well, we parked it pretty damn quickly, didn't we? In fact, we did, I remember. We parked it pretty quickly, so hopefully... Easy, thread the needle, thread the needle. Easy. Nice and slow. Oh, oh, there it is. Look at that, guys. That is some really sexy parking right there. Give a like for that. Give a like for that parking. Beautiful. Right in there. Oh, yes. Look at that. Excellent as well. 5,837. Are we going to... Oh, no. I thought, I thought we were at the end of level 5. Apparently, we're in level 6. Not bad, then. So, make sure to subscribe if you're new to the channel. Like I said, hit the like button. I'll see you next time.